I told you not to interrupt me again, Joel. This is what happens when you mess with the king, baby. All hail King Gus. So, like I was saying, I had the Tyrannosaurus Rex in a headlock. I was about to finish him off when suddenly... God damn it, Joel. What now? He said you're not wearing your crown. How do you know? Uh, yeah. He's saying since you don't have your crown on, you're not the true king and you don't have any power over us. Oh, come on. He said like two words. He also said it's time we rise up and revolt. No more oppression! No more oppression! No more oppression! No more oppression! No, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. I have the crown. I swear. I, I think I just left it in my office. No more oppression! Okay, an infinite hallway with doors. But which one's my office? Mm, okay. Uh. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, hey, sugar. How about a dance? Um, no thanks. Where am I exactly? You're in Dark Chocolate's world now, baby. Have you met the girls? This is Chocolate Chip. And this one is Thunder. Gross, you named them? I'm just gonna go. You look like you've got a satisfied customer already, anyway. <laughs> Please help me! <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Any one of these could be my office. Maybe this one. Hello? Hello? Huh. I always thought it'd be smaller. Hello there. Do you work here? Do you know where I am? Me? It's your brain. What? It is? Man, this is fucked up. Huh. Always thought it'd be bigger. Everything is so messed up. What's up, Monty? What the? Access denied. You are not supposed to see this. Yet. Well, that was weird. Alright, I got a good feeling about this one. Where the fuck is my office? Hey look, it's Barbara! Everyone's favorite- Nope! Jeff? Is that you? Of course it's me, buddy! Who else would it be? Kinda hard to tell, to be honest. You ready to go on our double date? Double date? With who? With these two fantastic ladies! Hi, I'm Dom! And I'm Cunt! No! Seriously, this is getting ridiculous. I know, man. This grass tastes like shit. I'm never gonna find my office. Gee, complain more. At least you're not tied to this one spot. I don't need a talking goat to put my life in perspective! Just shut the fuck up. Wait, don't go. I can help you. You said you were looking for an office, right? I was just in one. There was a shiny crown that tasted like the worst grass ever. The crown? I need that! Which way's the office? Um, well, I'm not too good with directions. It's a goat thing. But if you emancipate me from this stake, I'll show you the way. Okay. That's better. I'm not used to standing on my feet for so long. Or ever, really. Let's go. Whatever you say, talking magical goat. Okay, this is it. Are you sure about this? Yep. My goat instincts tell me so. Finally, my crown! <gasps> the fulcrum! I should have known it was you. Yes, tis I, the missing piece of the world, and my evil pet, Flatbush the Platypus. Trademark. Give me my crown, Fulcrum. Never! I am the new ruler of the podcast land. You were the one who locked me up. You're a jerk, you know that? I don't care, I'm king now, and that entitles me to be a jerk now. Bow before me, subjects. Bow and be subjected. I'll never bow down to you! So be it! I'll deal with you two myself! Flatbush! Attack! My eyes! <laughs> Prepare to die, fool! <laughs> hey, no fear, not the face, not the face! <laughs> goat! Help me! Get him off! I'm just a magic talking goat, what can I do? Don't you have any other magic powers? 
Hmm, let's see. No! Not bad. Whew, we did it! Man, thanks for your help, Goat. You're the best. Hey, no problem. I think we both learned today that... Whoa. Behold, I am the Pizza God. You have freed me from my imprisonment. As a reward, you may have the hand of my beautiful daughter, Princess Pepperonella. You will marry and rule the land of pizza together, ushering in a new era of peace and happiness. Sweet. <laughs> it's good to be the king. So tasty. Mm. Oh, come here. Yeah. Nom, 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 